Alex Lohman didn't think a state government problem hundreds of miles away would affect her. Uh, students like myself around campus are contemplating whether we can essentially afford college anymore. The 20-year-old receives Cal Grants as part of her financial aid package, and so do 58,000 college students across 23 campuses in the California State University system. Because lawmakers and the governor have not struck a deal on the state's operating budget, California is literally going broke. And to keep the state on life support, the government has had to withhold payments to students in need. It's pretty much a fraction of what um, I should be receiving and what students should be receiving. Um, it's kind of like a pending, in lieu type deal. Um, so what is promised is minimal at this point. So to keep people like Loman going, the system is fronting whatever aid it can before the actual money arrives. The same goes for University of California schools. Uh, the University of California has uh, made the decision that we will advance funds uh, to students uh, so they will not be uh, hurt or have their enrollment disrupted. UCLA's financial aid director says it's a temporary fix. After that, administrators will have to look at other ideas. The budget woes are also throwing county governments into a tizzy. We have the ability to deal with this only on a very short-term basis. Los Angeles County expected $1.4 billion in state aid to help fund social services. The county's Board of Supervisors may revolt against the state if a stalemate lasts more than a month by not sending tax revenues to the capital. Lawmakers cannot agree how to close a $42 billion deficit. The icing on the cake, further inaction will touch millions of Californians. Those who have already filed their state tax returns will likely get IOUs instead of real checks. John Moan, the Associated Press. Los Angeles.